So before we get into today's video, I want to apologize for the gameplay. Normally I would show my face, but the lighting in my room sucks. So enjoy some random replays from EDO Pro, a Yu-Gi-Oh simulator that is millions of times better than Master Duel. Let's get into the video. So Triff Gaming, you may have heard of him. He's just a little popular with hundreds of thousands of subscribers. Well, in case you've been living under a rock, Russia has decided to attack Ukraine. Now, I'm not going to get into the politics of it all. I'm just telling you the facts. Russia attacked Ukraine. The end. Well, I guess Triff voiced his opinions on the whole situation online, whether that be on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, I don't know. But the response from Yu-Gi-Oh! Memes 2.0 is what I feel infuriates me the most. And keep in mind that Yu-Gi-Oh! Memes 2.0, the Facebook page, is the same page that I already talked about in my Funniest Master Duel post from a couple weeks ago. The person that runs that Facebook page or a group of people, whatever it is, are so foolish. And my video goes into that. Well, this is what they said, I guess, after seeing Triff's post about the Russia and Ukraine conflict, wherever it was that he posted that. Canadian Yugi tuber Triff Gaming tops 1YCS and suddenly thinks he knows everything. Let me remind you at Steven Travinsky, his real name, that you got banned for cheating and your opinions as a duelist with no legit cards are irrelevant, especially those on the political level. But at Yu-Gi-Oh! Memes 2.0 is here to award you this L as a reminder that you should stick to creating content for a game you can't win fairly at. Hashtag kill clout. To which Triff replied in Zodiac Duelist after seeing a picture of this by saying, this is taken wildly out of context from the biggest soy boy in the planet. I'm not out here campaigning for Trump 2024. I'm simply stating the cold hard facts that if Trump, or to be quite frank, anyone else was in Sleepy Joe's shoes, we probably would not be in this scenario. If you disagree, that's totally cool. I'm not out here hurting anyone. I'm just stating my opinion, which by the way, is a fact. Now look, I don't know if Triff is a cheater. If the man was caught in 4K and none of this is alleged, then yeah, he should be banned for cheating. But what bothers me is Yu-Gi-Oh! memes attacking him as a person for what he believes. Now, I'm not here to say what anyone believes is right or wrong. We all have our own opinion, and we should all get along in spite of differences. But I think Yu-Gi-Oh! memes going after Triff and saying he is a cheater, allegedly, is idiotic. Now, on the flip side of that coin, Triff, you know how the community is. Majority of people know how you are. You say a lot of jokes. Think of the jokingly bit that has been going on for a while. And this is where I branch off into two different opinions depending on Triff's mindset. Triff, if you did this just to get clicks on your videos, that is probably the most disgusting thing anyone can do. How can you justify using what is basically a full-on war to garner attention to yourself and to your YouTube channel, regardless whether or not it's on a public Facebook page or private group? That is fucking awful. Now, if he is doing this simply to voice his opinion, Triff, I got advice for you. As I said before, you know how the community is. There are many trolls and many others who will say this post is bait. Keep politics out of Yu-Gi-Oh! Because someone is bound to make a meme, despite whether you're serious or not. And honestly, all the heat and attention, positive or not, is just not worth it, especially when it comes to politics. As for Yu-Gi-Oh! memes, assuming Triff didn't do this for clout chasing, Yu-Gi-Oh! memes, what right do you have to say he's chasing clout when over half of your shit posts are talking about how Master Duel is great, when in reality it sucks ass? This is why I don't waste my time with Yu-Gi-Oh! groups on Facebook unless it's competitive, because you just don't know what you're talking about half the time. I have proven on this channel multiple times how other simulators are better than Master Duel and how Konami is a dog water company. But hey, keep getting that free product, bro. It's got to be nice. Now, if things come out and Triff says he did all this for clout, then yeah, I'll retract my statement. But at the end of the day, for your own mental sanity, keep your opinions especially political to yourself because it's not worth the headache. And Triff, if you were caught cheating, then clean up your fucking act, dude. It's a children's card game. Do you really have to cheat to feel better about yourself? I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, a like would be appreciated. Subscribe and hit the bell. And I will see you guys on the next video.